And behind the net, it's Bjorkstrand. Checked by Hartman. And a good hit by Hartman in the corner. First to the puck, though, is Cartier. Keeps it alive to Yanni Gord. Yanni Gord protects the puck. A little stutter step in the right wing corner. And now a tie-up as Hartman crashes into Fleury. Those two go down. Hartman looks injured. And Fleury's slow to get up as well. And the officials stop play. I'll tell you what. You got to keep an eye on the lower body, maybe the knee of Mark Andre Fleur. He just nodded to say he's Seattle okay. number 22. The call. And that collision caused by Bjorkstrand, who draws an interference minor. So it will be a power play for Minnesota. Yeah, and watch Bjorkstrand in front. He gets inside body position on Hartman and literally bumps Hartman unsuspectingly into Mark Andre Fleur. And it's the weight of Hartman down on the pads. Here it is from the overhead shot, Shu. Watch it. It's the right leg left on your screen of Mark Andre Fleury. It buckled underneath him, so fortunately he's okay as of now. But we'll keep an eye on that as this progresses. And they found him open. It's Kaprizov onside once again. Try to seam pass. Nicely intercepted by Jared McCann. McCann flips it out in front. Kaprizov has it. Score! Number 46 on the season for Kirill the Thrill. And Minnesota takes the early lead. Some real clinical puck movement here by the Minnesota Wild. It, it's the chemistry between Zuccarello and Kaprizov if you win a board battle and get this puck in the hands of the difference maker. That's 97 in green. Watch the agility, the edge work. The way he just opens up and gets a little separation from Borgen. Snaps it home, no mistake. So Bucci, your request of him maybe getting five tonight <laughs> to hit 50. He's far away now at this point. The count is on. Yes, it is. As he has number one and plenty of time to get the other four. Yes. Right down in front of me, guys, Ryan Hartman and Oliver Bjorkstrand have been going ever since Bjorkstrand came off from the penalty kill, talking about the bump into Hartman than when his body went into Fleury. Both are not happy about it, and there's a great debate in exactly how that went down. And uh, they've been going here for about two minutes. Well, it's their last chance to do something about it until possibly next October. Fair.